Hello and welcome to the conversation with today I'm joined by Stacey Ellison. Hi. Um, so first of all, who I was gonna say who are you but just um, you are an aspiring singer and you're performing here today. Um, now what is your background in music? I don't know, ever since I was little I enjoy music and performing. Um, I remember in little school when I had like, loads of confidence. Little school. <laughs> Probably no shots in there. No, it was like primary school. Like year six, I think. Maybe younger. Anyway, I was, I was like, there was a little stage in the yard and I always used to sing on there. And, yeah. So ever since then, just, yeah. So, are you excited to feel performance or are you nervous? Both. So, what songs are you singing? Treasure and Everything Has Changed. With Joseph Neal. Joseph. We had a chat with him earlier and <laughs> our interview went on for about 23 minutes. Now I don't think, I don't know if you, I don't know if you guys will see that, that whole 23 minutes, however, yeah, I'm going to have to talk about Okay, so let's go on to some fan questions. Yeah, um, your next one is from, I don't, you've not left your name, but you've left your Twitter name, so I'm going to have to read your Twitter name. Um, it's from at Cat X I E. How you say it? Um, it says, "Who is your idol?" And um, have you met him or her? Gabs is my idol, and yeah, when I first met her, I had a panic attack. <laughs> You've met quite a few times now. Yeah. yeah. Um, your next one is from this is this is quite a bad question, Kelly. She says, "If you could make your own band, name three famous or non-famous who'd have who you'd have in your band." Gabs, Shay. And Jason, because they're okay. Well, thanks for the phone. Um, your next question is from Shannon. Favourite song and why? I haven't got a favourite song. You're yeah, sure? I haven't. Oh, I. Everyone's got a favourite song. I'm going to show you this out. I don't know. So, she's not got a favourite song, so Shannon. <laughs> if you want, you can go and tweet her. I'll, I'll, I'll tweet you her Twitter name and then she'll answer it after you. Okay. <laughs> your next one is from Gabby and she says, who's your male and female celebrity crush? Right, no, no. Oh, okay. Right, no. I've got a feeling one of the people who is, she's going to say might be on the series <laughs> inside the next couple of episodes or so. So, if it is, because I've not asked the question before, if it is, then you can leave a comment on both of the videos and we'll oh. try and match them up on Twitter somehow. And I'll leave a link in the description. So all you have to do is click on it and then tweet it and it'll go to both. Who is your male and female crush? My female crush is Gabs and my male crush is Josh Taylor. Just I think I, I, I think I just saw him right about it. I, this is something about, but I didn't recognise who it was. But I kind of recognise the first name, so you'll see him in a bit anyway. Um, your next question is from Gabby and she says, who inspired you to start singing? Gabs. Do you know what? I like Shelton's to be really <laughs> No, no, I, no, I do. Just to get you into the um, Your next question is from Megan, and she says, What's your best memory of performing today? Yeah. yeah. Um, if you're wondering why I'm referring to this event quite a lot, we'll have a chat about this at the end, and yeah. you'll know why this event. Um. Uh, now, your next one is from Rihanna, and she says, How would you describe your first performance? Now, this is quite a, but this is quite a question because her, her first public performance is today. It's not? Yeah, it is. It's not. My first perform public performance was Nushin Park. Nushin Park? Yeah. Okay, Clinton. Okay. Yeah. How was that? It was great, but my first performance was horrible because it was like in your and I had to perform in front of the music box and I made everyone face like the other way. So they went looking at me, then I faced the other way, so I went looking at the And now I look at the other like really awkward because why did I do that? <laughs> um, your next question is from Rebecca and she says, If you could be one piece of furniture, what would you be and why? Now Beth Nicholson said a sofa. 
Not a shirt and sock. Well, I don't know, because I wouldn't want people sitting on me, so... So what would you want to do? I'd have, because everyone wants you to. A bed, because I like my bed. So she wants everyone to lie in there. That sounds really wrong. Pile on stairs, sir. Your next question is from Mia, and she says, Have you always loved music? The next question after that is from Ellie, and she says, Who were you most excited to meet today, other than me? Me. Um, me. Me. All of them, Ellie. Oh. Yeah, that, that question will get answered at the end. It's because we're here with the event, I organise it, it's a bit. Yeah, you, you'll understand at the end. I've met some of them, but like the ones I haven't met, I was okay to take them to. Um, your next question is from Jessica. What is your favourite food at Andrew? Pizza. No, McDonald's pizza and I am real. Um, your next one is from Tilly and she says, your favourite band or artist and have you met them? Yeah. So, yeah. See, some of these questions I've already answered before. Your next question is, if you weren't a singer, what would you be and why? I want to be an um, issues and beliefs teacher because I like Muslim. A what? An issues and beliefs teacher. Alright. Alright. Because it just seems. I, I, like, I thought you said a shoe, a shoes and beliefs. Because it's not like God just about like God and that. It's like God's stuff about animal rights and everything. And I like having debates about it. Sorry. Right. So your next your next questions are about the next topic. Now this topic is this charity CC. Now I was asked quite a couple months ago to join this event, and you know me. Stacey and Poppy, we work quite close to try and get the event together and you know, to get an interview with them, sort of by a pass. Um, you know, the lineup has been created, which is an incredible lineup. It's been changed so many times. Because people have dropped out, but you know, we've, Not very good. we've got some really, really talented artists joining. For the people who dropped out, we've replaced them with better people. And you know, we have, we have had people, we have had people saying they're not going to come because of certain artists are coming and really this, yeah, event, this event isn't you know me stating but we don't get anything from this event we don't we don't get, get profits we don't get nothing it's this event is purely to raise money for cancer research and what you know one of the key things was the promotion side is people if we'd announced that certain artists isn't coming share the quiet <laughs>
find Stacy. Where can we find you? Underscore Stacy Allison. Facebook, Instagram. Stacy Allison. Instagram Stacy Allison. Bad. Snapchat. Anyway, Stacey, thank you for being a conversation with that.